This is Dr. Kevin Elko with the Victory Report. If only, and what if? I was walking around after the Alabama football game with Mississippi State, and I came across a friend, a very, very successful friend, who was having a tailgate with his company, talked with him for a while, and told him, I'm looking for another friend of ours, and his tailgate, and, and this man's face changed. He said, yeah, him and I, the guy you're looking for, we're very close friends. We were at Alabama together as students. We walked on and played for Paul Bear Bryant. What an honor. And one day, in just a few moments, we talked each other into quitting. He said, as he got sad, I can't believe how fast it happened. How fast. He said, I've always regretted it. We're walking away, and my, I said to my wife, I said, you know what's interesting? I bet he's successful because of that, because he kept the pain of quitting in front of him. We have a CD series on DrElka.com called GSD. Not quitting, but even more importantly, finishing, bringing something to completion, and keeping it in front of you. If only I didn't quit. If only I completed it. Can I tell you what the answer to if only is? What if? What if? Peter Sange is a consultant, a speaker. He's at MIT. And he was speaking one day, and a man named Fred came up to him and said, I had a terminal illness. He told me I was going to live. So what was important became more important because I didn't have time. And what was less important became even more so less important. Then I got a second opinion. And the doctor said, you're not going to die from this. It's curable. It's rare. They started to cry. The doctor says, why are you crying? You should be happy. He said, I'm so afraid I'm going to go back. You know, getting stuff done, bringing things to completion does have a timetable. And us realizing that we have to keep what's important important and what's less important even more so. Bringing it to completion, getting it done. I want you to have one of two statements. What if only? That's regret. What if I found what was right with my family? I found out what was right with my job. As opposed to having regrets and sitting around talking about what's wrong with it. What if I quit pouting and got something done? What if I had a self a sense of self-respect because I got something to completion, just not did my job? What if? What if we did this? What if we took the next step? What if we GSD'd, got stuff done? You have a choice if you get conscious. Real getting stuff done is, what if? What if we did this? Wouldn't that be cool? This is Dr. Kevin Elko with the Victory Report. If only, or what if?